All right, so it's that time of year when relatives from all over meet at your home, not my one. So if you're thinking to spruce things up or even looking for a last minute gift, well, look no further. We have everything you need right here. Well, this young lady does, interior decorator, yes. Nicola Hall. Morning, welcome Hi, to Smile Jamaica. Morning. Thank you. How are you? I'm great. You're missing the cold? No, not at all. <laughs> I, even though it's hot, I love it. Yeah. yeah, I asked her that because she's a foreigner, actually. She goes back and forth to, to Toronto and then Canada. Interior decorating. Yes. Where that start, where that come from and why? Um, you know what? I've always been creative. I've always been someone that dabbles into fixing up painting, always into some kind of artistry. So like years ago, I was just watching this show, was talking about how they redesigned and decorated homes. And I'm like, I could probably try this in my space. And I found such a love for it. It was just so natural. So I just, hey, went to school and here we are five years later. Went to school mean by the thing, or you literally went to school? I went to school, <laughs> finish, get me everything. To, to learn interior decorating? Yes, yep. Oh, so there absolutely. are specific things to interior decorating? Absolutely. There are things that pre people don't know, like for, for instance, scale, how to do textures, how to mix colors, how to do symmetry. All those things are a part of design. So some people might think, yeah, we can do it and yeah. them do things. And then it's so off balance because you don't know that certain colors don't go too well together. And certain then where textures. you place certain right. things in the living exactly. room exactly. Like Levels. Yeah, that kind of yeah. happened to me because I put down something and I walk past it and I go, so. And I said, but that doesn't look so good. <laughs> and then I move exactly. it again and then I come back exactly. out and I say, no, and I put it back there. Right, uh, So right. this comes naturally to you? Yes, this actually comes naturally. What about naturally. the person who lives there? That has anything to do with how you decorate? Absolutely. Um, because in, in everybody's taste is different. So I take that into consideration all the time when I'm doing any form of decor. Because I may like, for me, I'm a black and white lover. So that might not be a color or something that you might right. connect with. Right. And then it all depends on the space, how much light comes in there, you know, where it's located, how high, how wide, how all of that is taken. How important is that for my peace of mind and stuff? In other words, when you come into my house, I like to know that everything is in its place yeah, and there's yeah. a place for everything. How important is that? That's absolutely important because um, the whole purpose of having a house that function is for you to be in it and enjoy it. So if it's disorganized, if it's not to your liking, or if it's your family, because I think most people don't take that into consideration. You might like a particular thing, but if you have a family of five, then I have to put that in yeah, mind. Right. You know what and I mean? if they are young kids yes, and stuff. Yes, absolutely. All right, let's start from that way. You don't have to touch, and you, you need to stay there so they can look at okay. you. But let's start, and you explain what you've brought. What about, well, what's the, I can't see the lime and stuff. Yes. So that's basic. Yeah, that's basic. So I'm basically just showing some simple ideas that you could use to kind of just spruce up your table. Yeah. Um, lime, this is probably something that you will use right through because I don't really like wasting things. Okay. So if you have like a nice jar, you could put some in there. You could do apples, anything with like just a little bit of color. Okay. And then put it on your table, put some little flowers. So this is pompous grass. Um, pompous grass. Yes. Uh, so it's very common right now, um, something that persons are using in their home. It's very simple, it's very subtle. Some do shed, some don't. Where you um, put that? On your dining table? Yeah, your, you put it on your entry it? table, your center table, even in your bedroom. Okay. It works well. It's, it's a very soft, nice kind of grass, so it works. And you pair it well. Like for me, I paired it here with like, this nice mirror. Because you know gold is like a Christmas But thing. where you put it? Anywhere in the house? Yes, you can put this at your entryway. You can put this over your, your dresser. Because I always say I prefer to have the mirror hanging and then your dresser area empty. So okay. you can play around with the okay. surface. Um, Christmas, again, is fixing up. Candles. And a little candles. The scents in your home makes a whole lot of difference. No, no, me and you can first. smell this one. It's no, like me's a, really... me's a candle I do. <laughs> I love this little ball there. Yes, so I am big on lanterns. I have but always... But it doesn't light up, does it? No, but here's the thing. Like, you can purchase, like, really, really cool lights, and you could add it because they also have lights that are round, so you could probably just put it underneath. Okay. And then in the night, you're like... I like it. Nice, because subtle, yeah. I like it. 
We can't turn down the light. Them. <laughs> right, we can. Oh, no, the boss, so we can't turn. Down right. Them. So it's yeah. one of those creative things that you could do with. I, I like that. You know what I mean? And I spray painted that because that was black, so I changed the color to the, blue. The cage. Yes. Is, is, is that the cage? Yes, you can call it the cage. Yeah. Well, is that the official name? Please? Well, we call it lanterns, but I mean, oh, hey. Yeah. All right. You know I, I mean? like it. And this little fella. Yes, yeah, so that's another lantern, a much more bigger one, more familiar. Um, so that's another way of using it creatively. Um, you just put some little stuff in there. That's a nice centerpiece for your dining table if you don't yeah. want it too much It almost looks stuff. like it could be an outdoor patch. Yeah, absolutely. And it could be a gift. It could play a game Christmas morning and say that's the gift that you know, someone wins. More candles. More candles. And cushions. And then you play around with your cushions. I think people need to change their size and style and buy those covers and put it over. Change your pillows without buying new ones. So yeah. So these are just for the couch or where, where yeah, you couch, your bedroom, you have your have pillows for outdoors now. So anywhere where you're gonna cozy up and feel. Yeah. Are these just for Christmas? Are you take them down when Christmas don't No, that's here? the whole point. You can let them stay as ever because you know with Christmas you think about putting it up and you feel good. Then you have to think about taking it all down. Yeah. And then storage and so it eliminates all of that. Yeah. If someone wants a little consultation from you, what they do? Ah, uh, definitely. So I'm on all social media, Nicola Hall Designs. You could DM there. You could also email Nicola Hall Designs at gmail.com. And you can reach me and my assistant will get to you or I will get to you either or. And then we take it from there. There are certain guidelines and you follow and get me in. Give me an idea. I guess you probably won't know, but what would be, just give me an idea of a cost to, to do my living room. And it big boat inside, right? Or something. Your living room, depending on what you want. Let's just say ballpark, you want a nice couch, air rug, the full nine. Yeah. That can run you per square feet. I won't do that, but let's say 200,000 plus. For my living room. For your living room. So you have to put on the plus. You couldn't just have a 200,000. <laughs> 200, you never know what I run into. 200,000 plus one. So it's 201,000. <laughs> <laughs> Good to see you all the very best Thank to you. Thank you so family. much. Just lovely seeing you. Yeah, man, interior decorator, Nicola Hall. Uh, stay with us. We've got a fun stop. We do.